this message brought to you by the official Oddworld Discord server, featuring updates on Soulstorm and the Oddworld ARG, and the chance to talk to Oddworld forum members Crashpunk, Xavier, and Pop Benny. If that seems a bit too crowded for you, you can always check out the Oddworld Legends Discord as well, featuring modding content from users such as Captini and Mario Music. Both links will be in the description. Hey guys, Saxdo26 here, and welcome back to the Let's Play of World Abe's Odyssey Extras. Today we'll be taking a look at Cheats and Codes! Okay, listen up! Eight years on, and I still regret making that intro. But yes, today we'll be taking a look at the cheats and codes present in the original game. And starting off, we've got a pretty straightforward one <laughs> that's only present in the PlayStation version. In game, hold R1 and press up, left, right, square, <laughs> circle, X. Now when Abe parts, <laughs> it's green and visible, as it is in Abe's Exodus in every game since. It's kind of cool to think that that was originally intended and is part of the game's code as an Easter egg cheat, but it's really nice to see that not only was it planned from the start, it's been in every game since. Even the spin-offs, even the demakes, and of course, came back okay, from human intensity. <laughs> Only present in the PlayStation version, the next cheat is one I didn't explain properly the first time around. <laughs> in game, hold R1 and press triangle up, circle left, X down, square right. Now, when you talk to a native Mudoka, you can solve any voice puzzle with one game speak. <laughs> How friggin' cool is this? It applies to ones who give you soul rings, solve puzzles, pull levers, even the ones in mosaic lines. And what's even better is I recently found out that this cheat also applies to sleep voice locks. Provided you possess a sleep, it can solve any voice lock with one game speed. Alright. And now for the cheats present in all versions of the game. Hello. Here at the PlayStation version at the title screen. Hold R1 and press down, right, left, right, square, circle, square, triangle, circle, square, right and left. Okay. This gives you access to the chapter select, allowing you to select any area of the game, including the return areas from the second half. What's really good is that this is also present in the PC version. Access it from the title screen by holding shift and pressing down, right, left, right, left, okay. right, left, and same areas, same chapter select. And of course, if you leave the menu, you unfortunately have to re-enter the code to get back to it again. While the cheat isn't present in Oddworld Follow and Tasty, me. the chapter select is. It's given to you after you escape from Rupture Farms, and is a much easier way to go back to previous areas and make yourself better in terms of your escapees and your Quarma, rather than having to start right from the beginning again. It's a welcome addition in the remake. Follow me. Just one cheat code left to go, we're back at the title screen of the PC version. Hello. Hold shift and press up, left, right, left, right, left, right, okay. and down. Which gives us access to the cutscene gallery, which normally you only see by saving all 99 Mudokans and getting the Angelic Korma ending. However, there is one cutscene missing, because it's only present in the PlayStation version. Hold R1 and press up, left, right, square, circle, triangle, square, right, left, up, right. Okay. Again, the same list of cutscenes, but at the very bottom, we have the Guardian Angel commercial first used to advertise the PlayStation release. And of course, because that's an English commercial, it is completely absent from the cutscene gallery in Abagogo. As with the chapter me. select, new and tasty already includes the gallery once you start the game. Of course, you need to unlock all the cutscenes yourself, meaning multiple playthroughs, to get both endings in the gallery. But it's nice to see that it's included from the get-go, just like the chapter select is. And with that, we've now thoroughly shown off all of the cheat codes for the original Old World Abe's Odyssey. This has been Sax226, thanks for watching, and I'll leave you with the credits from Abegogo, which are different because they include an instrumental track of the music used for the Japanese commercial of the game. I'll see you next time when we start talking about the Quarma of Old World Abe's Odyssey and New and Tasty. See you then.
Wait, what? 